What's up everyone and welcome back to week 14 of Lorenzo's Locks. I'm Lorenzo Reyes and this is my ninth season covering the NFL. Every week I'm going to hit you with the three bets I feel most confident in my locks of the week. And this season we've partnered with Tipico, so be sure to click on this link so you can play my parlay of the week to get boosted odds. And let's kick this off with a line that I love because I actually think the Cowboys are being undervalued here. Yes, they did hit their midseason funk there for a bit, but they're finally healthy with Randy Gregory likely making his return. The O-line issues have been a bit of a concern, but Dallas is 5-1 against the spread in its last six on the road. And while Washington has been hot recently, and good to me, they're just 1-3 against the spread in their last four NFC East games. And this Washington football team is just 2-4 against the spread at home this year. So I'm on Dallas as road favorites, winning comfortably 28-17. Moving on from one NFC power to another, I'm loving the Buccaneers here for a number of reasons. But let's start with this. When Tom Brady is the starting quarterback of a team facing the Bills, his record is an astonishing 32 and three. That is the most victories in NFL history against a single opponent. Now, the Patriots and the Buccaneers and the Bills are all very different teams now. But Buffalo has some serious concerns on offense with their lack of balance and struggles in the red zone. The Bucks have won their last eight straight up at home, and Buffalo is historically poor against the spread in Tampa. I love the Buccaneers here with the points, 27 to 20. And finally, I'm switching things up and looking at an over-under that is really appealing. The Broncos rank third in scoring defense and 23rd in scoring offense, while the Lions rank 29th in scoring offense. The under has hit in all but two of Denver's games this year and its last six in a row. For the Lions, the under has hit in eight of their last 10. In mile high where points are harder to come by, I'm counting on this being a low scoring game and I'll be on that under with the Broncos winning 17 to 13. Hey, sports fans, if you want to learn more about sports betting, be sure to follow us on our YouTube channel and be sure to check out all of our exclusive tips and fantasy coverage at betforthewin.com.